Hi guys, Griffin here. Welcome back to Schlub Souls. Uh, you can see I've changed my gear a little bit, um, just mixing it up because I've used the weird mixture of the black sorcery set for a, quite a while. So, got soldier, hollow soldier helm, the wanderer coat, brigand gauntlets, and the hollow thief tights. Ah, singed my ass on the bonfire. So today we are going to roll along through to Sin's Fortress, or Sin's Funhouse, depending on what you like to call it. Um, despite the frustrations that uh, are encountered in Sin's Funhouse, it is one of my favourite areas. <laughs> Off balance, you got destroyed. It's always, it's, the janky, um, no, it's not really platforming per se, but the, uh, having to navigate the pendulums and that sort of thing, um, is probably the most frustrating part about this area. Now, my usual practice. Where is it? There. Not poison. I always prepare in advance for this section by getting rid of this guy here. Just because I'd rather not time my uh, crossing of the pathway up above whoops, with having to deal with his lightning attacks. didn't quite get him, he's got a sliver of health left. And as you can see, I'm still having issues with my <laughs> precision aiming with this controller. Let's goad him to come down as well. And he'll either get knocked off, or we'll just deal with him when he gets here. What a smooth run he had, right up until the end. Someone died there. A shame for them. As I find actually like once you surpass the need to um, get by all of these pendulums uh, and unlock the elevator shortcut, the cage elevator. Uh, exploring this area is not a big deal, um, and is actually quite fun. But he's not quite dead yet. I'm just going to keep you at bay there, so you can continue to get Boulderized. Um. Oh, that wasn't the most efficient way of getting rid of him, but that's okay. It's really just about patience, this level. There we go, now I'm safe. I brought back the longsword because I was, um... It's been a while since I've used it, really. Um, and it's... The way that I've leveled now... Um, it's got a satisfying ability to... oh shit, way too far, way too far. Oh, 
that's good. Last time I came through here, the um, serpent men were still alive, and Sigmire hadn't done anything about it. Hmm. I think that's his last dialogue. Hmm. Yep. I don't know how much I really want that show till uh, off the edge there. I probably won't risk it. No, yeah, it's already on its way. Now, let's see. There we go. Whoops. <laughs> Not the button press I wanted, but there we go. The Chotel. 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 Never quite sure how to say that. I think my natural instinct is to rhyme it with hotel. <laughs> but that doesn't seem right. Okay, now, in all seriousness, we can carry on. Picked up a ridiculous amount of bows. What was I using? That one. Probably a waste right here, but there we go. Now I'm going to get the fun times boulders, and I'm optimistic. Just made it. I used to be that I used to strip down everything, take everything off, so I get the fastest possible run speed uh, for that section but I found if I'm lightly equipped to fast roll usually it's enough for me to get by it's probably my least favorite set of pendulums and also just because of what awaits on the other side it's very much a I like to kind of just sit and wait and just feel the zen. This is definitely... A, last time I came through here I had such trouble with this section. Um, so I'm just switching to my pyromancy for Oh oh what the fuck? Ah the grab move Which like almost never happens. Yeah, you get punished for that. Usually not standing still around those guys long enough for that to happen. I should be alright now, so have cleared them you and stagger whoa oh a jewel there we go large titanite shards always good made good time actually on this area well yeah if you're just passing through it's not actually that long I'm just trying to get to what do I have on me do I have any no projectiles so it'll have to be hum what will it have to be don't have any crossbows on me either, so that's alright. I'll just try a long bow it up. Whoops. Just 
Just gotta be faster than him. This one... I've had more trouble with this set of pendulums and walkway with this controller because of the lack of precision and the whole you walk in the direction of the camera but so far so good howdy rock giant do this quickly before he wakes up and realizes what's going on. Bonfire, and we are golden. I won't tackle that just yet. There's a few things I want to take care of, and I won't do my usual pass by. Uh, now, I probably want to actually adjust my setup for that guy at the top. And just over, so I'll go back to my classic crest. Okay, chuck one my way, if you wouldn't mind. Okay, and off we go. That was close. Uh, I can't remember, I don't think the master key works on this. Nope. Oh, I'll come back for that in a wee while. Now, let's see what precision does for me here. Way that was dodgy as book. God, that's the jankiest run through there. <laughs> oh, loot box. Alright, come on, boyo. I'm here to do the thing. Ah. Just gonna do the the nutting out. I goad him into his angriness. Can't even see how much health he's got. There we go. And now I'll just. Oop. Dun dun dun. Dun skis. Again, I've never tried this. Yeah, didn't think so. Excellent. That's job done. Moving on to the next point of efficiency. Switch back to my long sword again. the ridiculously long tower of stairs. Let's get my health back. Well, stamina I should say. 
leapt right into that one. That's so satisfying. I love the long sword. Then we're going to go all the way back. Actually, actually, as we look at my beef jerky face, I thought I'd do homeward, but actually, um, I might not. Should I go down there? I should probably go down there. Oh, that's a hell of a lot of health. Oh, that was satisfying. fucking around there now. I have the high ground! <laughs> oh, first parry attempts of the day. Um, Fair enough that I don't get them. I never really bothered parrying those guys. There's only really a small subset of enemies that I actually attempt to parry regularly. But now that that's all sort of taken care of, we can go and grab some bits. Oh, I can get that on the way up. I'll just do this. Because it's time... to gain some humanity. this power right through to Iron Golem. But on the way, we'll unlock this. Ah, no, I'm getting out of here. Just to get that elevator into operation. Take this a bit slower now. Not wiggle around too much this time. How did he die? Get cornered by a bunch of people, I guess. Alright. Iron Tarkus. Give you some space. Meet you there.
And now back to the focusing. And Iron Tarkus Bro is here too. You take one shin, I take the other! Oh! Holy shit! Oh, I've never been able to do that! Ah, I just missed it, I think. That's alright. <laughs> Magical. Woohoo! That was way, way easier than I thought it would be. Excellent. Well, that leads us to Anne Orlando. One more run left to get through to the, uh, the, whatchamacallit, the giant blacksmith. <laughs> I'd say that's a very productive run. Um, and yeah I guess I will travel up to Analondo and end it there for today <laughs> that scythe it's kinda like a if you imagine like a ski lift sort of thing it's like I have this attached to my body I just hook myself onto the cable and ride up to Analondo <laughs> and then it's just all like Banana! look at this vista it's amazing or as my friends like to say congratulations You've reached Anna Londo and you've now completed the tutorial to Dark Souls. <laughs> well, that's that, guys. Uh, very productive straight run through Sin's Fortress. Didn't really do any of the side stuff, which I might mop up off camera. Um, but we're nearly there. I'm nearly at the Dark Soul, and uh, that's very exciting. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will be back soon enough with maybe the concluding episode to this Schlub Souls series. Uh, very likely, I'd say. Um, so until then, have yourselves a good one, and I will catch you next video. I'm out of here!